Hello friends, welcome back to 70th to Die, and bad things are about to happen to me because uh, my game crashed while I was recording. I got about, uh, about 15 minutes of episode, and I, um, I uh, was out exploring, and I just spawned here. <laughs> uh, yeah, this is where the game had locked up on me. Or sort of where the game had locked up on me. But, uh... It was daytime. It was, uh... It was daytime. <laughs> and now it's not daytime. Um, I still have most of the inventory that I, that I looted. But the game itself uh, reset to a... Set to the time of when the, I think this is when my last save uh, was, or last like uh, game. Go. What am I trying to say is, it's reset to the same time as my last game play moment. Just got some bones. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and scrap this again. Uh, I'm gonna scrap this because I don't want to carry all this extra brass pieces around. Can't scrap that yet. I can eat that. So yeah, hello, welcome to Seven Days to Die. I am. Um, uh, the plan is just to do a little. Uh, uh, so a little bit of exploring. So I've been exploring around for a while. Let me show you where right where we are here. Eh, let's grab those. So if I look at the map, yeah, it didn't even keep. Yeah, it's like seriously wonkificated. So this is house. So I came up this way. I basically I needed a break from building, and so I came up this way. I explored this. Uh, cave system that was right up here. Basically, it's uh, two just really shallow caves, and this thing, this thing just extends over. It's kind of an interesting little little thing. Um, then I came over here, and there was another little shallow cave system. Basically, it's a big like like a mountainside with a little bit of a like two block drop, and then up here the mountain's higher, so it's a you know cut in. There's a little campground here, and uh, kind of looked at that, and then I. Checked a couple of these houses out across here as well. Even I, I think I actually would cut across that way. Because there's a little town there, yep. So we, uh, I actually followed this road up this way. So we'll have to kind of redo some of our exploring. Because it's a stupid game. My whole computer locked up, so I can't actually blame the game. Um, I'll blame the... I will blame the thing. Ooh, it's a nice football helmet. Right. Uh, painkillers. Alright, is there anything else I need then? Let me check you to check you? Yeah, check you. Okay. Let's get ourselves. Now, where's the bike? Where's my mini bike? Um, I had parked the mini bike here, and then I'd followed. We had gone up this road, and this is up here is where the game crashed on me. So I'm really hoping that uh, my mini bike is sitting up here. Otherwise, I am out a mini bike, which would be most sad. I think I've got all the parts. I think I have an engine and everything to build another one. But I'm not so positive. So did I loot that house? Duke's tokens, yes please. Looking forward to using those in the new vendors. 
Maybe. I mean, in the first few days, yes. But after the first few days, I don't think vendors are really going to be that helpful. Unless maybe it's just purely for brass. In which case, you're going to want your tokens anyway. So I don't... Uh, I don't know. I'm... I'm... If they sold things that you couldn't loot, that would be a thing. But if they're just going to sell the same things that you can find everywhere, then after f the first few days, you've got such a surplus of stuff that I don't know if it's all that important. So yeah, damn it, I lost my bike. Yeah, I might as well since I'm out, out, on foot now. So now I'm far from home. I don't have a, I don't have a mini bike. Uh, I got 87 gas left though. Put those on. Uh, scrap that. Get rid of you. I'm gonna get rid of the A7 gas because in the arrows. Let's scrap that. Gas start condensing for a longer journey. I am wet. Give me that wood. All right, so we are there. The, my my plan was to follow this road. And just see where it led me. Uh, but now my plan has changed, evidently. Pretty sure that was where I... Uh, let's double check. Because I feel like I was, coming up, I was coming up over a rise when the game just died on me. And my save, my uh, video recording got corrupted too, which is why it's not a continuation. Was I coming up there, or was I coming up? Yeah, I must have been there. Oh well, such is life. Ever get people get so bent too when they lose their mini bikes? It's like, yeah, just a game thing. Just the game object. Hello, you decayed mother. I also forgot to bring a uh, wrench. Oh, paper. Uh, paper, uh, not paper, a wrench along with me to dismantle some cars. Uh, you guys didn't miss, I went through a big uh, burn biome. What else was I talking about? Oh, I was talking about the uh, the new traders. I'm assuming by now you guys have all seen uh, Mad Mole's uh, A15 preview trailer 1, which looks pretty good. Um, yeah, like I said, I'm not, I'm not so super sold on the traders unless they can sell things that, you know, just hard to get otherwise. Because frankly, it's, you don't really get that many tokens as it is. So I'm not sure if, the, oh, there's a little tower or something. Ooh, cool, 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 cool. Oh, and I asked uh, what you guys' favorite biome was. Where do you guys prefer to set up shop, or if it's 
if your favorite biome is different from where you set up shop, let me know that too. Last thing I'm saying, my, my favorite is still the pine forest. I mean, maple forest. It's, it's not like it's... Uh, oh. Okay. <laughs> that was a bit of an over uh, overreaction. Oh, shit. I just uh, just saw that I was out. And now I'm not out. But we'll use this for a while. Whoa! I'm really glad that there are shadows in the game. <laughs> Okay, you can have a sandwich. Have a sandwich. There you go. One for you. One for you. One for you. One for you. Another one for you. Do you need another one too? Boots. Here, why don't you uh, keep this dog food just for you? This is a pretty good sized little... This is it crossroads or is it a town? I guess we'll find out here in a second. But I'm getting a pretty good uh, array of zomzoms. I think I also made some comment about how, uh, you know, for all their talk about cutting back on the amount of food given out. that I'm still finding a lot. You're playing. No! I'm just trying to heal, lady! I was, I was saying. It's like one of those things where you make, you make a lot of comments when you're when you're recording. And you're like always trying to come up with things to say that aren't just you know same old boring things you always say. And um, I was talking about how uh, I'm on kind of like a, a vacation. Well, I am on vacation, but it's a I call it a staycation. Everyone calls it a staycation when you stay at home because the intent was to save a bit of money up for a, maybe a touristy vacation later this year but um, so far I, I planned a few household maintenance kind of things I planned uh, dryer vent cleaning and uh, carpet cleaning I got, a, I got a horde too didn't I the baskets. and uh, this turned into a thing uh, damn it! <laughs> Every freaking time! Oh shit! Oh! Oh, that was just... Ah! Uh, that was bullshit. This has been not a good day. Oh, not a good day for this. What's up? Well, I guess now we can find out if we got all the parts to make another bike. So, what I was saying was okay i need to get a frame uh oh chassis chassis uh wood for you we got 
one chassis. Cut that up. And then I need handlebars. Um, isn't that handle handlebars? Uh, it's been a while. <laughs> Don't make these a lot. Uh, duct tape, leather, short iron pipe. Ooh. Okay, let's let's make this stuff first. Duct tape, leather, short iron pipes. I think I need those. Um, I think I got some duct tape. Did I just didn't I just turn all my glue into? Uh, I think. Yeah, I think I just turned all of my glue into repair kits. So let's um, need you, and I need. Uh, what else do we need? We need cotton. Do I have a supply of cotton? 15, 17. Okay, so handlebars we can make. And then mini bike handlebars needs a headlight. Got that. I don't think we have another engine, or do we? Uh, two duct tapes. Okay, now we've got wheels. We got a set of wheels there. And I don't think we have another engine. Um Can you disassemble? You can't disassemble it. Okay, well, seat. Grab the seat. The chassis should be done by now. Turn that off. So we need, let's see, where did I put Do I have a wrench still sitting around anywhere? Are you done? You're done. Wrench. Do I have a wrench? I can just make one. I just thought... Um... Alright, well I think we're going to have to go and try and find a new engine. And we'll need a gun to go with us. So who, what do we have for ammo? We have pistol, a lot of pistol ammo. Um, and we can make, we can make some uh, shotgun ammo. I think we've got a shotgun. Oh, that's right, I used the cloth as well. And then do we have a shotgun already made? Oh, we got a magnum already made. I guess we could go pistol. Uh, 
Oh yeah, I want to bring that crappy SMG along. Well, that was just freaking unfortunate, wasn't it? Four thirteen. Oh, it's a better barrel, so we can look at replacing that at some point. Okay, so what do we not need to bring with us? We, we let's put the bike together up here on the surface. Um, other than the cotton, I don't need the duct tape. I don't need the shrimp pipes. Those I don't need any longer. Bones I don't need any longer. Leather and the gunpowder. The rest will bring with. And what I'll do. Thinking, oh, you know, I should grab us some uh, first aid kits. I was getting way too lax there, wasn't I? I was like, eh, it's not, I can just keep, you know, barely healing with first aid with pain pills and taking it. But no, I did take it in the back of the head. They just kept coming. Like little trickles of zombies just kept coming and coming and coming. All right, so it's going to be the adventure on the way back. Make sure I don't have a engine sitting up here. We need to get rid of these. All right, so yeah. Oh, okay. I, I started to tell you. So all my all these little things I've been doing on, around the house. So I got the um, dry cleaner guy came and did the dry the 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 uh, got all the lint out of the dry cleaner vent pipe thing the jiggery, and found out that there are um, loose tiles or loose shingles on my roof. So I had a roofing contractor come out and look at it, and there's a whole segment of, uh, this whole section that weren't nailed in properly. So it was a radiator, nice. Uh, so now I've got a appointment with him for, you know, 500 bucks to have him fix the roof. And then I had the um, carpet cleaning guys come in and they hooked up to the outside water, you know, with the outside water spigots, and turns out that it was cracked over the winter and fro you know, frozen cracked, and now I've got a really bad leak there, so I had the plumber come out to come in tomorrow for two hundred bucks, so they're gonna fix that. No engine there. So it was just yeah, just one of those vacations where it would have been cheaper to go somewhere. <laughs> oh well. That's what owning a house is all about, right? Come on, give me an engine. I hope I get I pull an engine along the way, and then I can ride back. I just got a battery. Make sure you didn't pull an engine yet. And just to make sure as well, let me make sure that I actually do have all the parts. Uh, that, that. wheels and the seat yep so all I need is all I need is an engine so hopefully one of these little cars along here will uh, take care of me real good like I didn't bring any food I didn't bring any water talk about your not good thinking thinking problems Ah, got two cars up here. Come on, radiator. Engine me up, baby. I can't believe I didn't have a stockpile of engines. I guess I really, I kind of stopped looking for engines a while back. And now I'm paying for it. Now is the time that I will pay. Oh, well. Ah, well, that was, a, it was an a very interesting episode. Very interesting day. We will get back to the build. Um, probably be a couple episodes of adventure. Because I just need to, I need to mix it up. And I feel like I've been inflicting just nothing but building on you guys. So I need to, I need to mix it up. Hello, young lady. Hmm. 
Nice switch. Oh, I should probably grab the bandage just to have a bandage. Since I didn't... Oh. Actually, no. Since I forgot the fact that I actually did... I was smart enough to bring first aid kits. That's one saving grace. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to be uh, running along. Um, when I finally find an engine, I'll bring you guys back for the next episode. But for now, it's been wrong with the bold. I hope you enjoyed this bizarrely, bizarrely weird episode. If you did, click that like button. Let me know in the comments below. Tell me again about your favorite biome. And I'll talk to you all later. Bye-bye.